Hey guys, it's me, Luna. Hi, hello, and welcome back. So today we are at Ingleton Falls. Talking to the moon. Ingleton Falls is in Cornforth and it is a 4.3 mile mile trail along two rivers river doe and the river twist river twist yeah um and it's open seven days a week usually from 9 a.m and during the summer it's open until seven it is eight pounds for an adult and four pounds for a child and car parking is free there seems to be a overflow car park as well because the main car park is full so I will put a picture of the little trail on here and show you where we're going to go um, it is a one way system with social distancing in place so it seems all safe it's got a little cafe we're just heading to the ticket office now this is at the far top end of the car park this looks like the river gel and that looks like the river Oh, it's the river twist. The noises here are so peaceful and tranquil. Like you can hear the water, you can hear the birds, you can hear, the, you can hear our feet on the gravel. <laughs> so nice. Me and, Lu me and Luna made a, sh a footwear boo boo though because we should have wore walking boots. We knew that we'd come to see waterfalls today, but we had absolutely no idea of what we would actually find. Watch till the end to see all of the waterfalls we find today. This is just absolutely beautiful. I am literally just in awe. If I put my glasses on today, I can make sure I'm seeing everything. I don't want to miss a thing today. No, we don't. It's just too beautiful. It feels like a lifetime since we've been surrounded by so much nature. Um, so today is like a lovely little gift. Look at that cliff over there. You can't see it really in the um, Yeah. It's like really high in sheer. What is it, Luna? It's a money tree. It's a money tree. Now what money? They can't be taken out. Wow. They can't be taken out. I think they're people's wishes. You need to leave people's wishes where they are. <laughs> oh wow. I've never seen a real life money tree before. Yeah, we're not far from uh, Kendall from Kirby Lawn Style. And I think um, there's a little village, Ingleton Village. And I'm sure it's one like a country life village of the year at some point. So it probably would be a nice place in the country to come for a little short week, a little short break, or a staycation, as the new term is. Found a waterfall. <laughs> oh, that's a little fairy one, like a little fairy doll. So a lot of the trail is only wide enough for a single file, one person at a time. And I think that's why they've said once you go in. 
you can't really um it's a bit like ikea you can't just get out where you want you've got to keep going on your trail um so you can't just turn around and go back the way you've came The trail seems to go up for a little while and then back down to the river level. It says not to get down there but down there. I can't help but wonder if there's any parents here who do the, um, I don't know the term, but who are less at risk of this than me. Like I, I love the idea of, I love that Luna's fearless, but then my heart is in my mouth all the time because she doesn't, she's a kid and obviously she doesn't risk herself, it's not her job, it's my job. She doesn't listen to me when I do it. So I'm constantly scared she's going to hurt herself. But I used to know a woman who... <laughs> cute. I used to know a woman who used to... She never used to say to her children, stay safe. She never ever did it. She used to just say, have fun. And I love that idea. But for some reason, I just can't... I, I can't manage to do it. <laughs> so any hints or tips about how to become a less risk averse parent, please let me know. I don't think Luna's noticed yet, but there's a big waterfall there. Oh, <laughs> yeah, she's seen it. As we headed to the first waterfall, we still had no idea for what would come next. Go on, tell me what the sign says. Danger, pack of falls. This area is dangerous if you leave the path. Please keep to the main footpath and supervise the children. So stay by me, okay? There's two. There's three. Oh my gosh, that's so nice. Wow, isn't that beautiful? Okay, this place has just stole a little bit of my heart. Dessert, there is quite a few steps here. I did say on the website that it's not suitable for wheelchair, for wheelchair users or people with mobility issues. It's suitable for people like me who just need the extra exercise. It's quite wet on the floor here. These are the first set of waterfalls, Pekka Falls. The things I would do to be able to jump in that right now. I feel very contradictory because I've just been talking about it. <laughs> being risk averse and trying to keep Luna safe whereas I'm ready to get in that water So we've just walked up higher from those three up there and we get here and there's more there's like three behind me sorry so 
so it seems like there's about six or seven um, areas of it cascading down. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Yeah. Hang on a minute. Smileys! They certainly got higher then. Wow. That's the kind of sound that soothes your soul. <sighs> this is a well placed drinks cabin shop thing let's get a nice cold drink <laughs> Luna's just said she's walking like Captain Jack Sparrow <laughs> careful she scares me to death Two. <laughs> <laughs> Do you know, come on. Then you kind of so let's see where we are. We've only literally come from there to Hacker Bridge there. Oh god, we've still got loads to do. Still got like half of it to do. Wow, we have. We better get cracking. Like the sheer, sheer rock surface with falls coming down the sides. Look at that. So, this is called Thornton Force, Ingleton's impressive waterfall sketch by Turner, and it really is. I wasn't expecting to see this just like round the corner. It is absolutely stunning. Everyone that I come to, I think it's like going to be like the nicest one. Round every little corner, there's something more. <laughs> so she she just managed to get up. I'm just going to see if I can get a picture of her. Oh. It's easier to get a this is absolutely incredible. And why not have a photo shoot with your new Disney purchases? It is called a trail, but it's very much a hike. Just up from Thornton Forest is Raven Bay, and you could have also sat here for a few hours. It was really, really beautiful. But it was after there that things got really steep. I think we have to climb all the way up there. God help me. God help me. <laughs> That's a cute little bridge thing, isn't it? It is a very, very windy at this point. Skinny bridge. Oh, oh I can see right underneath me. Oh, gosh. Gotcha. 
there were a lot of stairs at this point and it did test my level of fitness let's confirm that i am very out of shape um, and this was a really really good workout the views at the top were incredible and definitely worth being out of breath and the burn in my thighs <laughs> think that this is the highest point look how beautiful that is um there's an ice cream van but i've just said to luna let's wait until we get to the bottom because if it does get any higher i don't think i don't think i'd be able to eat on the way up any higher than this really caught me breath then we just found a little teepee over there and there's like a little van this looks like a farm on top of the hill I just told Luna that when I was in the Navy and we'd we'd go on like um, on a trek and we'd be given a map and we'd have our Bergens and when we get to a path that looked like this, like straight path, we knew we knew that we'd be by the end goal and the end game was we'd always meet in a pub and we were allowed to have two pints, a meal and a pudding and it was like the biggest treat in the world. <laughs> That's what this path just reminds of me then. Right, we're heading to Beasley Falls now. This van felt like a lovely little bit of respite then, didn't it, Lim? Yeah. I've just got um, a cappuccino and a flapjack. Yeah, I got, got a brownie. A Luna got a brownie. We're at Breeze. We're heading to Breezley Falls. So we're now on the far east side of the trail, and there is an alternative path, but I'm not sure what that means. Luna, stay on the path. Stay on the path. Oh, wow. Oh, look at that. It was clear that this side of the trail was much more rugged than the other side of the trail. Deep ravines and crevices that the water was just finding its way through. There's a quote that I really like, which is like, be like water. Water is flexible. It bends and moves to suit its environment. I think it's all about accepting change. We like water. You look like a little Elslin. Okay, should we carry on up guys? Let's go! And there's loads of places around with the fences but then bit that we've just walked down up here yeah, did not have a fence. This is the bit that we uh, that we came down here without a fence on it and it was it was quite a steep place. I do know him by the way. <laughs> He's not just a random stranger that I've just photobombed.
Yeah, but not decent ones. I wouldn't get one unless it was a decent one. And for a decent one, it's at least a thousand pounds. It's at least like a hundred. It is not. It's at least a thousand pounds for a decent drone. Ask him how much you got I'm not asking him how much it was. You ask him. Bet you're not brave enough. It's close enough. I think that might be the most beautiful thing that I've seen in a very long time. Those guys are really cool. They just was explaining drones to us and I really, really want one. There's like this little, uh, little tiny, tiny little bridge. Um, that we're gonna have a little nose. See what we can see. Whoa. It's cool, isn't it? <gasps> Whoa, look at that way. I think if this railing wasn't here, I would definitely feel like a lemming. Do you know I'd be sad? Would you? green as you come round the corner then I'm actually struggling to understand why we've never been here before We haven't actually seen anyone in the water and there is guidance that says do not get into the water. But I imagine in parts like this where you can see it's really shallow and there's not that much of a, a current drive in it, that people do want to dip their toes. Luna! Hi! She can't see me. <laughs> Actual spring water, it's amazing. It's perfect. It's so good. One last bridge. I think that we are nearly at the end. We still actually had quite a bit of walking to do to get to the end of the trail but it did flatten out at this point and we did get to see some rock climbing and some abseiling. So we finished it and we've just come out through the little village um, of Ingleton and you come through a church, I think it's called St Mary's Church. We are exhausted. <laughs> Not gonna lie, that wasn't an easy trail, it was stunning some of the most beautiful scenery that I've seen in the UK um, but really hard wasn't it? Yeah. So we would absolutely recommend you come, absolutely you've got to, but wear proper walking boots. <laughs> we really, really hope, hope that you've enjoyed, enjoyed this vlog. So on that note, don't forget you can click the subscribe button, hit the notification bell and leave a comment down below. So stay awesome, stay wild, don't let all the ya. Love you, bye. Mwah. Bye. Talking to the moon.